What's one of the most common and complimentary and loving things that most every couple, even if you don't have a great marriage, you're going to say? You're going to say, I love you. Love, see you later. Love you. Love you. I love you. You want to change the dynamics of your relationship. Add the word because and fill in the blank with something different every single time. I love you because you're my best friend. I love you because I'd rather spend time with you than anybody else in the world. I love you because you put the family ahead of your work or, or, or career. I love you because, and you fill in the blanks. Here's the thing. Whenever you don't say something good, by human nature, your spouse usually assumes something bad. I had to travel a week ago. I was on the road for three nights. I'm never gone that long. I was like miserable, homesick. And so I'm like texting Amy and I text her one morning. I, I said something kind of romantic and a little bit romantic, okay? <laughs> and then I didn't get a text back from her for like an hour. And then another hour went by. And all of a sudden I'm like, what's the matter? I mean, that was cute and funny and adorable and romantic. And she hasn't said anything. And then finally, she sent me a duck face selfie picture of herself with something very romantic back. Like, we're good. We're good. We're good. We're so good. We're good. Okay? When there was nothing, I was nervous. I mean, there's no reason to be nervous. But whenever someone doesn't say something good, we often think something bad. And therefore, in marriages, sometimes you actually are thinking something good, but not saying anything and robbing your spouse of the blessing. Listen to me. Every time you think something good, text it, say it, you show it every single time. You may say, well, I don't think a lot of good things. I just say, hey, say what you want to see. You know, you see anything that looks good, blessed. I'm like, I want him to be a spiritual leader, but he doesn't do anything. Well, if he prays over the Thanksgiving meal, go crazy over that. Oh, when you prayed, you were like a spiritual giant. You know, you're a blessing to me, and you're, you're, you're encouraging what you want to see. She, she may not know how to encourage you. She says one thing that's good. Oh, thank you for encouraging me. Oh, you made me feel like such a great leader or man when you did that. And so you encourage and you say what you want to see. Every time you think something special, say it. 